What's good, Crow Gang? How y'all feeling, man? I hope y'all had a nice, safe, you know what I'm saying, beginning of y'all week. It's almost the weekend, man. Tomorrow, Friday, you know what I mean? My week was okay. With that being said, though, today is my little man birthday, man. Today is my man uh, 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 acid birthday, man. We're gonna find out his real name today when I push up on him with these shoes, man. So, we about to go surprise him for his birthday, man, with some Yeezy 700s. He probably think I was playing. He ain't heard from me all day, man. Hopefully, he ain't. Well, I hope he is out enjoying his birthday, but hopefully, he ain't like I can't get in touch with him or in contact with him to give him, you know, his shoes, man, for his birthday, man. But we're gonna make it happen, y'all. I already got the Addy, man. I already got the Addy. So, he wanna meet me in person. So, if I go to the Addy and he ain't there, we just gonna have to wait till later, man. But, yeah, that's gonna be the rest of the content for uh, these last couple days. I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw a little, some little mixing masters in this video, man. Some stuff from the other day I didn't post. It is what it is, so. Yeah, man. Let's go surprise my boy Ashton, man. Let's go, y'all. Now we done made it to Micro Center, aka the Gadget and Gadget Store, man. If you didn't check out my first video of the Gadget Gadget Store, it don't even matter because you about to see it in this video, man. This store is like, it's amazing to me, man. It's so much stuff that they got in here, you won't believe it. And it's crazy because when you search online for like electronic stuff, they don't bring this store up for some weird reason. This junk do not pop up. You gotta literally know about this store, man. So let's head to Micro Center. For a fit check, I got something on my jeans, something black, but I did throw on my uh my uh blue uh jean shorts right here. I took it back with my Georgetown sixes, haven't worn these in a while, but I did bring these out for the day, and I also threw on my Georgetown Hoya navy blue shirt. I didn't go with the hat, but I did throw on my navy dark blue glasses right here, man. So we swagging out, we got my grams out. Micro Center, baby. See, I did not check out this earlier, y'all, but this is your boy's favorite spot right here, man. This right here is crazy. Like, this right here is crazy, y'all. I don't know. Y'all think we should get a game, man? Let me see. Let me see, man. Let me see, because last time I didn't know how to play, man. All right, so we off. Oh, I drive better in the dock. Oh, I ain't switched my gear, y'all. I'm sorry. Oh, oh, oh. What's Really gotta like hold on to this thing. Dark as heck outside. Turn. Turn this way now. I'm gonna leave him be, man, because now I see why they say you must be 18 or older to drive this rig. I say this rig, y'all. Oh my god, look at this desktop, y'all. What? Bro, 
You know how much fun I would have? And it turned. I was about to say, this thing got a turn, bro. It's touch screen? Stop. Stop, bro. Three grand? Dog, this don't like that, bro. What? What? You sitting back, you can play it like this. Then if you want to get closer, you can go like this, bro. Nah, this it right here. This is it. If I had me like a gaming station, this would be all I need, bro. I wouldn't even use two monitors, but it looked like you can split it, split the monitor in half. Cause when I turned it this way, it showed like two different parts. So when it's this way, I think you can like split screen this joint. Look, that's crazy. Dang, this Samsung too. Look. Wow. I thought it I thought it was touch screen, but it's not. Is it? I don't, I don't think it's responding to what I'm touching. That's crazy, y'all, but that's nice right there, man. But even I'll this one is not, it just this one just don't spin. Yeah, oh it do, it do, it's just locked. It's just locked right now. So this spin as well. Yeah, it's crazy, man. But let's continue to look for what your boys is looking for. I gotta keep my glasses off in this door. You need to be here in this area right here, like I told y'all, man. I'm trying to get some new headphones. My headphones are drunk and high right now. So I don't know what's wrong with them, and I can't talk. I can't talk trash to my uh, opponents, and I'm not liking it at all. I wanna be able to talk trash to my opponents. This is, I don't know. That one look cool, but I kinda wanna stay I kind of want to stay in the area of uh, gaming. That look like those for like tablets and stuff like that. I want to get something more so for my game. I like that the one that I had, I don't know why it launched out on me. We got one right here for 40 bucks though. We got one right here for 40 bucks. It might break in a week, but hey. So, these are the three that your boy like. These wireless, they 40 bucks, but the only thing with this one is it don't say that it's compatible with the PS5. I would have to like Google and see if anybody else uses CSA system support. Windows, XP, Vista, Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 10, and Windows 11. It says nothing about a PlayStation. So um, I'm kind of skeptical on those right there. So this one will have Excellent. to be eliminated. And with that one being eliminated, this one say PS5. This one say PS5 and this one say PS5. Now, we got $100, $40, and $100. So, boom, these 40, what? They are wired, they not wireless. Now, that's kind of good when it comes to me because I already got a wireless one that the thing that connects to the headphones already broke. It, it, don't, it won't connect to my headphones, so. Y'all want to spend a hundred bucks and, and got to worry about going through that process again? Or do I just say forget it, spend a little 40 and have one that connect that I can just plug into my uh, um, my my controller and just, just go on with it, you know what I mean? Or even if I didn't want to do that and I wanted to talk to the chat, I can plug it into a USB joint or an aux cord joint and still be able to talk to y'all if I wanted to. If I didn't want to talk to the gamer, I wanted to talk to my chat. So this one can kind of work. So yeah, and I can take that cord right there and stick it in another auxiliary aux cord and then stick it into a speaker if I wanted to and everybody can hear. So we're going to go with this bad boy right here, man. We're going to leave the wireless joints alone, man. Hey, hey, hey. I feel like there's nothing wrong with having wired headsets. Like sometimes when you stop and think you just you just put yourself in that place where you feel like you gotta have like the best stuff or the best looking stuff, but at the end of the day, you ain't doing nothing but hearing sound and talking to some bad one body. So this right here will do, Bob. This will do for your boy. So be good with this one right here, y'all. We're gonna uh, keep it pushing throughout the store. Oh, they got some mics right here on sale, y'all. $30? Wow. And if I ain't mistaken, it's a gaming mic. This is a gaming mic. 30 bucks, bruh. This one $15? If y'all don't get to the gadgets and gadgets, this one 25, bruh. This one look a little cooler. 
this one look a little cooler, man. Wow. Wow, 25. But look, hold on. Look at that. I ain't even peep. I just put this one down, man. This one is $15, bro, for a whole mic. USB microphone. It got the stand, mini tripod stand. It got the cord. Oh, this, this, uh, no. I can't, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'll stick this in the mic and put it into the computer. Wow. What should I get this one? Which one is better? I feel like the better one is the cheaper one. So, I got mics though, man. I really got mics. Oh, I ain't gonna need this. I'm not gonna need this because I, I, I got a mic. I got a mic. Don't I? And the headset. I got a mic. It's really nothing else for y'all to hear. Alright, y'all. So, everything worked out at least so far. So, we're gonna go with these headphones right here. We're gonna get a, a, a protection plan on it for five extra dollars. Anything go wrong, you can bring it back. Like I said, this is Micro Center located in Fairfax, aka the Gidget and Gadget Store is what I like to call it, man. They got everything you can think of when it comes to TVs, PCs, gaming, whatever you need. Make sure y'all come check them out. They got wireless headphones, wired headphones. They got that on spray paint. They got everything you need out here. But what's crazy is, like I told y'all in the beginning video, when you search stuff on Google that got anything to do with electronics, for some reason, Micro Center don't pop up. Because I done searched so much electronic stuff that I I was trying to find like this store for a pickup and everything was like shipping, Walmart, Best Buy. I never seen Micro Center. So if you don't know now, you know, I promise you. If it's some electronic that you need, bruh, they got it, man. I promise you they got it. But anyway, y'all about to grab these headphones. I'm about to get my capture card and we're gonna turn streaming. We're gonna take streaming to a whole nother level, y'all. We're gonna take streaming to a whole nother level. And hopefully y'all enjoy the content. We did jump down in a little driver shit, but hey y'all, I'm telling y'all, y'all gotta come check out Micro Center, man. I wouldn't lie to y'all, I wouldn't hold y'all up or none of that. This is the place to be. We're gonna grab what we gotta get and we're gonna get up out of here. Shout out to Micro Center, man. I did bring back the uh, the camera pen that I was telling y'all did not work. So that saved me big today, man. This was, um. $40 plus $5 for so if anything happened to it. This one was $170 plus $10 if anything happened to it. And the pen that I bought was like $100 plus tax. So once I returned the pen, my difference was really like 30 something dollars. But with the uh, protection plan, it was 10 for this one, 5 for that one. So that was an extra 15. So I ended up spending $53.98, y'all, on a $180 capture and the $40 headset, man. Hey, today was a good day. That was a good steal. I feel like I bought some shoes for a steal, man. So I appreciate Micro Center and my boy Sebastian over there. He definitely made sure everything went smooth for your boy. So we're we'll gonna continue to keep pushing. Let's go. Uh, so we right here at Crystal City, about to pull up on my boy Acid. Like I said, we're gonna find out his real name today, man. But we about to pull up on him. He right here at uh Crystal City Sports Bra. Oh, I said bra. Sports bra, y'all. He right here at Crystal City Sports. I was about to say it again. Sports Bar, y'all. He's at the Sports Bar pub right here. He actually three minutes away. I just got off the phone with him. So I guess he out with family enjoying his birthday. So we about to pull up and bless him with these sneakers. Uh, I think I did a pretty good job at, you know, trying to clean them up. But if he want to change his mind, I do got some other size tens, but my boy is a nine and a half. Mind you, I don't, I, I, I don't know him. Y'all see, I'm calling him by his uh, YouTube uh, handle. So, excuse me, I don't know him. I actually met him on YouTube. You know, he came in on one of my streams one day and was locked in. He's just like, man, my birthday coming up. You know, I was like, man, I, I'm, I'm gonna give you a blessing for your birthday, man. I was just about to give away some shoes, so I felt like, you know, why not? It is what it is, you know what I mean? And he young, man, he young. We gotta keep our young our young brothers on track, man, because there's so much stuff that they can get distracted with. So when they, when you got one of them that's not distracted, you gotta, you gotta show love and show support, man, to let them know that they ain't gotta go out here in the streets and try to find it because that's where 
uh, a lot of people like me, like 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 my generation. You know what I mean? I messed up like that. You know, searching around and stuff like that. Uh, you know, it, it it don't really do nothing for you, man. Looking for love out in the street or advice or just guidance or just wanting to, you know what I'm saying, be around, I guess, other men or, or people your age that's probably ain't even up to no good for real. But when you got somebody that's not like that, you can catch them, you know, at a young age and try to show them what's right or show them another way. You got you you gotta do those type of things, man. You gotta extend that type of hand, man. I feel like I'm here for a reason, you know what I mean? I'm definitely gonna reach my full potential. Whenever it happens, it's gonna happen, but I know that it's gonna happen. You know what I'm saying? So we definitely about to pull up on my boy, man. Surprise him for his birthday. We actually we should be right here. So where's that? Alright, so alright, so it's right here. We actually right here. I don't know where he at in the sports bar. Bro, I said bra, the sports bar. Man, my boy just turned 14, I believe, today. And he up in the sports uh, bar. I don't know why I want to keep saying sports bra, y'all. But he up in the sports bar. So let's go up in here, man, and meet my boy. You know, meet him in person. He's definitely excited to meet me, man. He been waiting on me all day. I had a couple other things that I did have to handle today. I'm a busy dude. Definitely a busy guy, man, but we going uh we definitely about to bring him these sneakers. I just gotta remember which box they in so we can get him the right shoe. I believe it's in this Air Force One box right here. I told him it was a replacement box, so he's like he's gonna keep it 700 up. And yeah, there they go right here, y'all. So these are joints we about to get my boy acid for his birthday. He thought your boy Crow, he probably thought your boy Crow was cap. He probably thought your boy Crow was cap, but I ain't cap, bro. I'm solid, you know what I mean? I'm one of the solid ones. So we got the birthday boy Jeremy right here. I hope he didn't think your boy Crow was cap. You thought your boy Crow was cap? I'm about to say, your boy Crow ain't cap. I had a lot to do today, man, but I wasn't gonna miss out. You had fun in Ocean City? Uh, I was one. You, what? Why would he lie to your boy no, Crow? I couldn't, I couldn't get him that day. Huh? I couldn't get him that day. Oh, all right. Well, you ain't got a lot of your boy Crow, man. You could have just been like, man, look, we got rescheduled, man. It's free shoes. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, we definitely gonna put it there. Definitely nice to meet you in a person, my boy. Make sure you stay solid. Stay out of trouble, man. Stay away from the troublemakers, man. Don't make the same mistakes some of us older guys made, man. I'm 20. I'm 27. I'll be 28 next month. I wish I could be 13 again, bro. So. Don't be too pressed to grow up. Stay a child, bro. Trust me. Enjoy it while you ain't got to pay for nothing, man. Mama doing everything or whoever looking out for you. Appreciate that and, and take it all in, bro. Because you're 13 now and from now on, it's, you start, you know you about to pay for your own sins, right? Like after 12, you start answering for your own sins. Mama ain't doing it no more. So you got to watch what you do out here. I do a lot of good than bad. Everybody ain't perfect, man. All right, y'all, so that was that. We gonna keep moving around, doing whatever else I gotta do, man. Shout out to my young boy. He be in all the streams, too, supporting your boy. And he just became a member, so that's what's up. Today is be there. We gonna wish him many, many more. So me and Jeremy, we out, man. We out, y'all. We out, we out, we out. Child, so I just pulled off from my boy Jeremy, man. And we had a nice little conversation, man. I, I met his mom. All right, I, I, I'm, I'm not going to say I know his mom, but she know me. We done crossed paths before, some of her family members. But that that that, that, that ain't here nor there, man. She's definitely a great lady, and she's definitely raising uh, uh, a, a, a good young boy. But with that being said, man, let me make sure I'm going the right way, man, because your boy Crow be forgetting, man. Boy, I be at Pentagon City like every other day. I still don't know my way. But, but yeah, man, uh... We had a nice little talk, man, and I'm gonna I'm be completely honest. I'm gonna I'm 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 keep it gangster with y'all. That talk almost brung me to tears, bro. Like I I, I kind of had to I kind of had to tighten up and buckle down for real, bro. Cause when I when I looked at him in person, like through 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 the live stream, you don't, you don't know who a person is, bro. You know what I mean? Person person can tell you anything. Not saying he was a bad dude. Like he's he's still young. He I can't even label him a bad dude. He's still young. He going he got a lot of mistakes to make. You know what I mean? Good, 
super good or super bad. You got a lot of mistakes and stuff to learn from. You only 13, but this is where it starts. And I say that to say, I wish somebody would have said that to me, bro. And I can't even, I can't even really say that because I, I kind of got to reverse what I'm saying. Like, I, I, I can blame it on, you know, not really having a lot of guidance, but at the same time, I wish I wasn't so stubborn as a child, bro. Like I, I wish I would have, I wish I would have listened to certain people that told me certain things, bro. I wish I would have, I wish I would have hung with them dudes that was trying to be my mentor and and, and and take me to the gym and and play ball and all the other old extra stuff, bro. Stuff that I was looking at, like, huh? I ain't trying to do that, you know what I mean? Or a uh, 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 older guy trying to tell me. Don't do this or don't do that. And it's like it going one ear and out the other because I'm worried about what my homies laughing at. You know what I mean? Or or, or worrying about leaving out of class because they about to roll out. Like, I, hey, I ain't going to lie. If I had a reset button, bro, even with everything I got going on in my life, bro, like even with all the mistakes I done made and how it made me the person I am, or whatever the case may be, bro, I, I, I probably still hit that button, bro. Because even to this day, I'm still going through stuff that I wish I can just reset, bro. And start over and, and, and not take that route, bro. Like, I'd probably be, like I said, I would be a dangerous man. If I can hit the reset button, bro, and go back go back to my boy Jeremy A's, bro, I would, bro. I would, bro. So, Lil' Bro, I know you probably watching this video, bro. Whenever this don't drop, whenever you get a chance to look at it, man, I know you and mine probably gonna check it out, man. If I can go back, and I told you in your face, bro, I told you in your face, and I'm gonna tell you too. If I can go back to 13, little bro, after everything that I went through throughout my life, all my achievements, all my mistakes, even with the stuff that I did that made me who I am today, and the lessons that I learned, bro, I press that button again, bro. I press it again, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. I do all them years over, bro. But I, I will not. I will be dangerous, bro. If I can go back to 12, bro. I mean, 12. Yeah, 12. You turned 13 today. So if I can go back to 13, bro. Bro, by the time I get to 27 again, bro, I'll be so dangerous, bro. I would be a dangerous man. I ain't talking about street wise and, and killing and being a gangster. No, I'm talking about my mind, bro. My mind, the way I think, the way I move, the way I accomplish stuff, how fast I accomplish stuff, the way stuff is so easy to accomplish, bro. I would be, I would be dangerous, bro. I would be dangerous, bro. But it do, I do carry a chip on my shoulder, knowing that I'm, I'm, I'm finally starting to. You know what I'm saying? Expand in the mind. Like the way I think, the way I move, how I want to move, and what I see myself, where I see myself in five years, bro. And if I would have took the time to really become that type of thinker at 13, bro, if I would have knew where I wanted to be in five years at 13, bro, and really started pushing towards that, bro. Bro, the world would have the world would have been in my hands, bro. The world would have been in my hands, bro. Like I I literally just started unlocking myself, bro. Like I'm I, I'm I'm solid, bro. Like I, I got my flaws and all that, bro. Like I'm real right here. This is a video I'm putting out, bro. I, I, I'm speaking to I'm speaking to YouTube and my viewers like like I know y'all. You know what I'm saying? But I, I'm solid though, bro. I'm solid, man. I I I I I gotta keep it real. You know what I'm saying? And with that being said. I, I feel like I just started like discovering myself, understanding myself, knowing not not I, I still don't always all the way know exactly what I want to do. I feel like I'm just starting to understand my purpose of being here. You know what I mean? Cause we ain't we, we ain't here for no reason, man. Whatever your purpose is or whatever you feel like your purpose is, fulfill it. You know what I mean? But I'm I'm I feel like I'm just starting to unlock myself. It's just certain small things in life that I'm just starting to understand and see for what it is, man. And and just stop making the same mistakes over and over and over and over again, bro. You want change, you gotta change, bro. If you don't if you don't if you don't change, you you gonna get the same thing over and over again. Like not that's kind of self-explanatory, bro. Like it's, if you don't change your socks, you ain't gonna get no clean socks. That dirt gonna keep building over and over and over again, and that's and that's the thing. I'm gonna say this right here, and I'm gonna end it right here, man. Our biggest fear in life, bro, is change, bro. It's change, bro. 
Like, and it, 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 it honestly, it honestly don't get no realer than that, bruh. Our biggest fear, and I ain't talking about no fear like shaking in the corner and scared, your heart dropping, you sweating. I'm talking about just making that decision, bruh. Just, just, just switching your mind frame to do something different or or change what you used to doing, bruh. Like, once you get used to something and you put that time in, it's hard to accept that change, bruh. You don't know what it's going to feel like to be without that everyday cycle, bruh. That this is what I know, this is what I'm used to. You know what I mean? Just like if you used to getting up every day to go to work, you've been working this job for the longest, and they fire you. You're going to feel some type of way. Cause you don't know what it, you don't, you never looked at life without having this income. So it's just that small, bro. Our biggest fear is change. So I say that to say, and this is a message to anybody that need to hear. Sometimes I gotta preach it to myself. You know what I mean? And I say that to say, man, don't wait till it's too late. Well, you gotta make that change, bro. Don't get stuck in a habit. You don't want to get stuck in no habit that you can't get out of because you're scared to change. You might as well push it to the limit. Be what you want to be right now. Start pushing now. You're never too young to start pushing, y'all. Whoever need to hear this message, anybody young that watch my channel, even if you older, it don't even matter the age. Age ain't nothing but a number. I know a lot of young as 13, 14, 15 think like they 30 years old. Think better than some of these 30 year old out. Uh, 30 year old. <laughs> nah, 30 year olds out here though, man. I know some youngers that, that know how to move regardless if it's in the streets or in them books or whatever it is. I know some youngs that's smarter than dudes that been out here for years. So the age don't even matter, man. You might as well take advantage of your time right now. Your time is now. If you want to do it, you might as well do it and keep pushing. Don't look back. Because once you get stuck in that habit and it's time to change, bro, it's going to be hard, bro. It's going to be hard. You get stuck in that habit and it's a bad habit and it's not doing nothing for you. When it's time to let it go, it's going to be hard, bro. And it's going to hurt and you're going to feel it. You're going to feel all of it. So before you get there, don't even put yourself in that predicament, bro. We got to pray, man. It take a neighborhood to raise these youngest, bro. But we can't even say that for real nowadays, man. We can't even say that. It take, it take the ones that want to help these youngers, because nowadays the neighborhood is not raising these youngers. The neighborhood is, is, is making them, not making them, but they steering them the wrong way. They telling them to rep this neighborhood. Like, that's, that. so they say it take a, uh, what they, a village? We don't live in villages. Ain't no project raising no child. For real. And that's just, that's just 100. Because you got a lot of dudes out here that they just out here. They don't care. Bruh. I know so many dudes that ain't even taking care of their kids, bruh. Real life, they ain't even taking care of their kids. Probably got like four, five, six, seven kids. The f But that's just what we living in, bro. But then, they come out here and niggas talk tough, get on that gangster and run the streets and do all this, bruh. You got a child to live for that you ain't even doing nothing for. Then you got solid niggas that's out here. It's solid niggas out here, bruh. It's, I, ain't, I ain't bashing all, I ain't bashing niggas. I don't want somebody to see this video and take it the wrong way, bruh. If the shoe fit, wear it, nigga. If the shoe fit, you already know you wearing it. You, you might as well don't even feel no type of way. I don't even know you. I'm talking to a camera right now. I'm talking to a mirrorless uh, uh, Canon R10. <laughs> so if you take it some type of way, that's on you. But it is some solid niggas out here, though. There's some solid dudes out here. You got dudes that deal with bras that, that got kids that's not even their kids and go hard for them kids. Go hard for them like, it, like it's they blood. Regardless if the bra, she can get on some whole other shit and he'll still be there. It's niggas out here like that, bro. There's solid dudes out here, bro. It's definitely some solid dudes out here, bro. I ain't, I ain't speaking like the whole world just... Just, just full of craziness, I'm just saying. 
We don't live in villages no more, man. Hug your loved ones. Let them know you love them, you guys. Call them. Text them. My mother just got on me today, man. Told me I don't call. I don't pull up. I don't text her and all that, man. So I need to tighten up. I get y'all this message every time at the end of my videos. And I need to tighten up, bro. I need to tighten up. A lot of things need to change with your boy Crow, man. But, hey, I got a lot of learning to do, man. I still got a lot of growing to do. Hey, I still got long, long life on this earth, so I ain't gonna keep making the same mistakes, but hug your loved ones, baby. Let them know y'all love them, and always, always, always remain solid, baby. And I'ma catch y'all when I drop another video. We out. Go game. Go game.